Peace be with you, friends. We can have your attention for a couple of uh, moments. Uh, two things. First, uh, I'd like to bring your attention to an event that is that takes place this Sunday across Canada and the United States. And it is called a life chain. In other words, it is a one hour long gathering of people from various backgrounds who stand for the gift of life. You see, the life that begins with the moment of conception. So friends, every child matters, and including those that are still in the womb. So I invite you to dedicate one hour and stand in silence to bring awareness about human life. Uh, there are four locations in Hamilton, but the closest to our school is the corner of Upper James and Mohawk. And the gathering starts at 2.30, and it, it's, it's the same location at the same time at all the locations. So again, this Sunday, for people who simply believe that life is, starts with conception, it's not a political, religious, or any other event, but for people of goodwill who believe so, uh, 2.30 at the intersection of Upper James and Mohawk. The other thing uh, I'd like to remind you, now it's regarding our school, is that uh, only a week away from the uh, beautiful pilgrimage trip uh, retreat to Midland <coughs> that you have seen the clip and uh, heard about it. So there's still a couple of seats on the spot. And for those who have taken permission forms, who have signed up, please return them by tomorrow. And if you are not just interested, but if you want to go, want to commit yourself to going, please come and see me today. Thank you so much. And now, once again, take a look at the clip. Have a blessed day. Attention history buffs, join us on Thursday, October 10th for The Walk Where They Walked. Imagine stepping into the shoes of 17th century French Jesuits and meeting the Huron Wendat people. At Sainte Marie, among the Hurons, you'll dive deep into Ontario's rich history and uncover the roots of the Catholic Church in Canada. This isn't just a field trip, it's an unforgettable experience. Combining history, culture and faith, reflect on your personal journey while learning about Saint Jean de Brebeuf a key figure in bringing Catholicism to Ontario. His missionary work with the Wendat people in the Huron region was instrumental in establishing the faith. Walk the same paths, enter the same buildings and feel the connection to our past. Dress comfortably for indoor and outdoor activities as you immerse yourself in this unique educational and spiritual retreat. Join us for the walk where they walked and witness history come alive. I am here for wrestling. I've had lots of kids come up and ask me about it, and we're going for it again this year. Last year in the city championship, we lost by a point, so kind of left a bad taste in our mouth, and so we're ready to move forward and really give it our all this year again, and hopefully we take some offset of titles as well. So wrestling, next week is our first meeting after school in the lecture hall, Tuesday, October 8th. After school, right after school, brief meeting in the lecture hall. Wrestling is a winter sport, so if you are in a sport right now, you can still join when you're done. Just come see me at some point to get forms, touch base, and let me know you're interested. Okay, so if you're finishing football, field hockey, whatever it is, we'd love to have you out. Um, wrestling, in case you didn't know, is a sport for girls and boys. Doesn't matter if you're 60 pounds or 260, you fight people your same weight and uh, boys versus boys, girls versus girls. So if you're interested, again, no experience necessary. We teach you everything you need to know. Just come out to the meeting to get some information. And then we will start the Tuesday after Thanksgiving. So the 8th is our meeting right after school in the lecture hall. And then the 15th, we start beating people up. Okay, see you then. Good morning, STM. My name is Melvina. And my name is Nika. And here are your announcements for today. Good morning, STM. The HOSA Health Occupation Students of America Club will be starting off today after school in room 333. Whether you're a returning member or just curious about health careers, come join the fun. We've got awesome activities planned and a chance to meet new friends. Don't miss out. See you there. Prefect tutoring will be taking place today on all lunch periods in student success. Come on by and get some help with your studies. And now for your sports. Congratulations to the junior boys volleyball team on winning 3-0 against Marys. The win moves them to fifth place in the league standings. 
Next game is at 5 p.m. in our home gym. Go Knights! Last night in senior girls basketball action, your Lady Knights took on Cathedral. Despite injuries and illnesses, the girls battled hard and came out with victory over the Gales by a final score of 62-57. to Melania Bozzo led the team with 18 points and Izzy Morrow chipped in with 16 points. Yesterday on the pitch, in exciting field hockey action, your Lady Knights pummeled BT 5-0. Amazing game, girls. Goals were sco scored by Lena Jolly with two, Kara Lejean with two, and Jordana Boschman with one. Fabulous shout-out by Taryn Bianco. Come support your Knights next Monday at Cathedral when we take on Brabuff. Go Knights, go. Thanks, STM. Good morning, STM. I'm Johnny, your spiritual rep. And I'm Mikel, your tech rep, and we're here with the student council announcements. First up, exciting news. Spirit World hoodies are officially restocked. If you've been waiting to get your hands on one, now is the time to grab your hoodie at the student council office every Tuesdays and Thursdays during the first 20 minutes of your lunch period. Our Halloween dance is just around the corner. Tickets are available now on School Cash Online, so make sure to grab yours and start planning for your costume. That's all for today, STM. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at STM underscore council to stay updated on all things council related. Have an amazing day. STM, those are all of your announcements for today. The time is now 8.21. And, and remember, it's a great day, day to be a night. night.